Right, I have a cold drink to soothe my shotgun, the soul, and I'm back. Let's have a look at the compass. It says I'm pretty fucked. That's good. I can read a compass. Uh, so, okay, I, I want to get out the uh, other guns. I think I... Do I have the pistols? I can't tell, because everything... Oh, yeah, they have a slightly different texture, don't they? I think, actually, they have a N on the side of them to stand for... It might be Natlor, actually. I'm not even sure, but, uh... This is a bit of a weird start. I can't see anywhere I can really go. I think this is just gonna collapse, isn't it? Is it? Oh. Oh, right. I see. Okay, so this is, uh, Temple of the Cat, I think it was called. Temple of the Cat. Meow. It's gonna be any cats. 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 Cats everywhere. No. No cats. Not yet, anyway. I'm gonna get ambushed. I, I can tell you that. Ooh, let's... There we go. Sorry, I had the um, frame rate reader on the screen, but I don't think you guys can see it, so it doesn't matter. I can pretend it never happened, but oh no, I've announced it, so you guys know. So I, you would just think I'm going crazy, otherwise, if I didn't explain myself. Uh, hello. Die. Oh, oh. These bars you can't shoot through, but the other ones you can. That makes sense. Makes a hell of a lot of sense. These are special bars that keep things out of them, whereas the other bars, they let things through them. Hello. Hello. These are the bars you can shoot through, but, yeah. Unfortunately, uh... I'm not... Uh, oh, these are mummified cats, aren't they? I think someone told me that a long time ago. Mummified cats. I mean, they, they, they kind of... Oh, for fuck's sake. No. Why am I doing that? Am I... What? What on earth? Why is that happening? Why is that happening? When I press space, I'm drawing my weapons. Why is that happening? I, that was not happening before. Is it because I've rebooted the game? The controls have gone... weird? Uh... Default key? User keys? Okay, it stopped happening now. I, don't, I, I think I need to set it to that every time I reboot. That would, that wastes me two bullets there, core design. Thank you. Uh, so I can climb up. I can climb up. I don't know if there's... Maybe I should probably pull that lever first. I think we'll do that, yeah. Because uh, I need to make sure I'm doing this in the right order. So I can find as many secrets as possible. <laughs> yeah, secrets. Love those secrets. Mm. So let's give this a yank. And what? Hello. Hi. You're very tall. Laura, what are you doing? You're trying to knee him in the leg or something. Well, oh dear. Uh, let's back away from him. This makes me feel a bit uncomfortable, admittedly. Let's pick up the med kit. Uh, if you could do that, please, Laura. Back up a little bit. I can't see. There we go. He's still not moving. He's still not moving. He's gonna, like, activate as soon as I get in this, or if I leave here, perhaps. Ah! Hello. Uh, was that a secret then? I don't... I have no fucking clue. Oh, God. Cannot get him because he's just all over the place. It's probably best to just back myself into this corner, actually, because I can't see. Uh, that... That was a bit stupid. Okay, um, uh, what I will do next time is I will try and get through the gap. That just didn't work out at all. Here we go again. Get the med kit. Roll. And get out of here, please, if possible. Thank you. Right, is he stuck? You know what? I've got standard pistols out. Uh. What's he doing? I'm gonna kill him just so he's a bit quieter. It might take a while, because if I recall correctly, these guys have a gigantic health bar, like one of the biggest in the series, actually. What is he doing? What is he doing? He's gone kind of a bit quiet. Oh, okay. That, that, that's special. There we go. Okay, so uh, I'm glad they stopped exploding for the record. That was, it was a bit distressing, admittedly. Let's get the magnums back out again. So this guy's here, still, he is wandering about over there. It scares the shit out of me when I see them on the hind legs. 
It really does. Can we can we not grab that now for some reason? Oh, of course we can't. Let me just readjust myself. There we go. You did it that time, Laura. Well done. Real proud of you. So, I'll save the game here. I know, like, we haven't made too much progress, but hey, we found a secret. It's reason to celebrate, right? <laughs> yeah, there's Temple of the Cat. Okay. Um, there must be something else here. There's going to be some kind of enemy or something. Oh, wow. This place is huge. This is gigantic. I'm aiming at something. I should probably start shooting. What? Uh. Oh, God. oh God, oh God, oh God, this too, this too. Um, can I not maybe, like, oh God, uh, just run. Run all over the place, that works. What was that sound? Something just opened. Shit, there's more, isn't there? There's probably more. I th it sounds like more. Certainly sounds like get, get, get up there, get up there, please, 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 please. Oh God, still being attacked. Keep climbing, keep climbing. They can shoot, can't they? But um, they don't seem too interested in doing it at the moment. Maybe it's not these ones that shoots at uh, boulders. Where do they come from? That's a lot of boulders, actually. Looking around, there is a lot of boulders here. Right. I'm gonna heal. We have eight small med kits, we're fine. Perfectly fine. There's so many places we can go to here. Guys. More shotgun shells. Hooray! I'm pretty sure there's a number of locations that shotguns actually spawn. Ah, save again. No harm in doing so, right? It only takes a moment. I know you can quick save, but I, I think I'm just going to get murdered by some of these boulders. What I want to do is I want to bring them down, ideally. So, uh, if I do this, perhaps... No? What? Okay. Just take the shotgun shells instead. That one just doesn't seem that interested. What the fuck? It's actually a little bit waylaid. I mean, it's like over that side. It wouldn't be able to get over here, would it? Oh, I don't know. But anyway, we need to keep an eye above us. These are- oh, a shotgun! These are probably gonna slide down and try and kill us in just a moment. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck! Whoa! Oh, okay. It's a good job I went- yeah, well, that's fine, that's fine. Um, I was just hoping that the- shit, there's another one around here somewhere. Um, how am I gonna deal with this one? I can- oh, shit. Well, okay, um, gotta really just- Fuck! Be fast, yeah. I've got a shotgun, guys. I've got a shotgun. We're gonna start using the shotgun, I think. Um, so I have so many shells at the moment, and I think it is relatively powerful in this game. Just pack a punch. Now, there was something groaning. I'm gonna go hunt it down. Where the fuck is it? Oh, it might actually be the enemy from the beginning, I think, because we can get over the other side. Though I could be wrong. Uh... I want to be very thorough with this place, for sure. I know you're game now. It's Tomb Raider Unfinished Business, but otherwise... Uh, oh, that's a block. That's a block. Uh, yeah. I think it is, anyway. Yeah, it most certainly is, because the smooth areas around here. Um, so let's pull it over this direction. I mean, we can't really do anything else with it at the moment. It must have some kind of purpose. But what? There are so many places we could potentially push it over to here. Oh, wow. Uh, we could actually move it all the way over here. Oh, God, there's a panther. No. Don't remember the shotgun sounding like that. Everything sounds a little bit more refined than uh, it does on the PlayStation 1. Oh, I know why. I think it's because the sound files are compressed on this version. Uh, maybe the other way around, actually. Maybe the other way around. That would make sense. Yeah. Why would they be compressed on the PC version, not the PS1 version? <coughs> Wait a second, is that moving? No, they're just sparkling, right, okay. It, it looks nice, admittedly. This does look really nice. So, obviously this game came out in 1996 early, so I assume it did. If it was extra content. Uh, oh, hello. It's a good job I jumped up here. Two shots, two shots. I think the shotgun actually is way more powerful. I'm pretty sure it is. Uh, 
much more powerful. Because, yeah. It's doing a lot. It's doing a lot to these guys, for sure. Oh, God. Uh, I can see that these two blocks below me, for the record, are definitely pushable. Or pullable. Pushable and pullable. Push pull blocks. Oh, we got a first aid kit up here. There doesn't seem to be anything else, though. Shotgun shells. I, was, I mean, um, in regards to platforming. Now, uh, one thing to note about Tomb Raider 3 and 2 in comparison to this is they didn't really have many levels like this where you could go really, really far up. You know, and above everything and just feel like you're on top of the world, if you get what I mean. That kind of came back in Tomb Raider 4, I think. Especially scaling the pyramids and stuff like that. That, yeah. It was pretty awesome. Uh, you know, I think I remember looking at the files for this, and I think it does have an expanded draw distance. So I think that's something the that Sardok set up. Bless him. He's so, he's so lovely, isn't he? Uh, right. There's a block up there. We can climb up there, but then I don't think there's any point, really. Uh, down here we have something. What's that? Oh god, Laura. Two keyholes, two keyholes. This is going to be like a objective of ours that we need to um, definitely work towards. And then there is a water pit down there, which we're probably going to get stuck in if we do slide down into. Oh, I think I might already be stuck, by the looks of it. Unless I can do some kind of crafty little jump over to the far right, potentially. Uh, huh. Oh god. Oh, never mind. We're up. We're up. Uh, yeah, because if you look at this, it's all sloped down into the water, isn't it? So, where else can we go for now? So, I don't really want to go down there just yet. I feel like that is kind of over to a place that we, at the moment, don't really... Oh, hold on a moment. Maybe we can get through here. How is that possible? The panther has just emerged from the wall. Hmm. Uh, maybe we can get out here, actually. I think we can. It was kind of hidden from my perspective. Yeah. Uh, well, I can definitely jump up from there, can't I? But then, is that too sloped? You know, I think we should be fine. But I'm not going to do it just yet. I want to figure out what the fuck these blocks are for. It's very unusual that there's uh, just so many of them scattered around. And I think... We might be onto a secret if we do discover the purpose of them. If we discover the purpose of them. Uh, where else can we go, though? Is there anywhere we can drop down to that we could get to where we were previously? But um, in a different location, if you get what I mean, like on the other side of the gate, perhaps? I mean, this might be. No, it isn't. Okay, so, hold on. Hold on. Got an idea. We look through... And we can see some stairs lead over to the left-hand side. So if I kind of just na navigate around here, but keep in mind that we need to be over in this direction or somewhere over in that direction in order to um, get down there, then maybe I should be on the right track to uh, figuring out what it is I need to do to get over there. So... Um, over this way... And round here, and there should be a gap. Maybe not there? Here? Hmm. The stairs should lead over here, actually, somewhere. So it should be, like, some place I can get down over this way. I don't think that's where I'm going, though, because I think that's where I just came from, isn't it? Yeah, leads over to the right. Uh, is that an item there? Shit, I think that might be an item just over there. Oh, fuck. I'm alright. Yeah, I think there is a little cutout here with just, uh, per yep, yep, yep. Some shotgun shells in. Cool. Uh, more shot- wow, okay. It's only two shots, I think, that we're picking up here. I mean, like, hold on a moment. We're on 36. Picked it up. We're on... 38. Yeah, it's just two shotgun shells each time. It's a bit weird that they come in a pack. With two shotgun shells. Yeah, I mean, like, you would just see... Well, it'd be kind of hard to spot them, you know, if we are just finding individual shotgun shells scattered around. Oh, how the Egyptians love their shotguns. And bullets, and more bullets. Uh, why have you reset? Oh, wait, no, you're not the one I was pushing around, are you? So that's that one over there. 
Oh, oh, oh. There's some shotgun shells underneath it. I didn't see those. Huh. Okay, well, first off, I'm going to discover what the heck the blocks at the very top were for. And then we'll have a look into see what this one might be for. Otherwise, it might just be for the um, for the shells that we just found. But otherwise, yeah, I don't know. I don't have a clue. Right, let's try pulling this out of the way first. So we can do that. And then, uh, I mean, this might be the way to jump over to there. But then at the same time, I don't think that's true. I don't think that's true at all. Uh, can we push it down, perhaps? Like, can we push it off the edge? Down to the bottom. Make a nice little stack of blocks or something weird like that. I don't think that's a feature in this game at all. I mean, I should know. I've played the first game entirely, but... Hey, that was, uh... Oh god, that was seven years ago now, yeah. <laughs> Fuck me. It's been a while. Uh... Ha! Huh, um, this... Doesn't seem to serve any purpose. Is there anything I can maybe swing across that I'm missing? I mean, there must be some reason why there's two random blocks up here. They're hiding something. Maybe there's a nice one to this one. Excuse me. Got a bit of hiccups. Uh, n oh, 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 okay. Uh, what's this then? Okay, uh, we cannot get back up from there, can we? There's a slide down, I think. I'm gonna save, and then we'll head down. Uh, there's the water area, there's this area. I think, again, we have an ultimate goal of maybe getting into, um, the place with the two keys. So, large med kit, a lever over there. Uh, nothing else here by the looks of it. No boulders or anything. That's good. What does this lead into, then? Anybody home? I feel like we might be on the other... Oh, there's one of the keys. Lovely. I feel like we might be, um... On the other side of where the gate was, perhaps. I'm not sure about that, though. What the heck is down on this side? Oh, scap, actually. Okay, uh, yeah, let's go up then. Up we go. Oh, okay, I probably could have made that if I wasn't grabbing. Oh, well. Um, can we... Yeah, we can get up there. So, uh, just walk... Oh, God, Laura, please. There we go. Come on. Come on. Fucking hell. Uh, I think we can climb up here, actually. So, this might be faster. Oh, no, 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 what? Oh, there we go, what the heck? Uh, I don't know why she wouldn't grab onto it, that was a bit strange. Okay, do a backflip here, and shotgun shells, lovely. So, this was just for the key. The other key is probably gonna be in the water area, or at least I believe. Otherwise, maybe we need to utilize the block. Oh, no, no, we're up in the area that I thought we needed to utilize the block to get to, so forget that. Don't forget our purpose anymore. Um, I think it is just to get the shotgun shells under it. Look at these illustrations here. I'm gonna have to look at them from a distance, because, like, otherwise they're so pixely that I can't see what the fuck is going on in them. But I think it's like a cat setting itself on fire. What? It's like a flame, and then th th there's a panther climbing up, or a Alligator? I don't have a clue, actually. I, I think I should look from more of a distance. I can't tell what it's supposed to be. Over this way. Okay, do a roll. Uh, huh. It looks more like an alligator now I'm looking at it from this perspective, but why is it climbing onto a fire? Is it suicidal? Does it just want to end everything? I'm... I'm <laughs> that might be the case. Um... Okay, let's... Have a more of a look around this area, because I feel like I was quite brisk with, um, checking out over here. Maybe there's somewhere you can climb up to. I mean, there must be a reason why that boulder's just sat up there for a start. It's a bit strange, isn't it? I was safe, but otherwise, maybe there's a way to get down into the area I was in before from the other side. I'm gonna try and activate it by... Oh yeah, there we go. 
What was the point in that? Where did it go? Or is that it? That, oh no, it's there. What was the point in that? Climb up there, maybe? Can you climb up there? There must be a reason for it. Unless Core Design just didn't mean to put it there and meant to put it like a slot over. That can't be possible though, because they would have to put the trigger there as well. Huh. Uh, huh. Let's try going the other side of it. No, can't get up there at all. There is no way to get there. Excuse me, sir. Could you potentially tell me how to access the room that you are currently residing in? I would very much appreciate that. Um, hold on a moment. What's this on the other side? It looks like a door, doesn't it? And it's actually here? On the other side? Here? Aha! So, there must be a way to open it. Okay, so I'm pretty much out of options. I don't know why I got in here. <laughs> Because, uh, that's not very useful, but I'm gonna go out of here and try and get out of here. I'm gonna go out of here and go into the water area that we discovered. Right, let's, uh, hop in then. Any alligators, maybe? Uh, no, no, none. That's strange. Okay, there's a lever there. And the door, door, there's a door. Okay, so we go and we pull this. Yoink. And that has... Oh, let's open that and there's an alligator. Okay, get out, get out, get out, get out. Go, go. There we go. Right. You. Oh. Oh, there it is. Is it dead? Oh. No. I'm gonna come a little bit. Just back up a little bit. Oh, no. It hasn't got stuck, has it? No, it hasn't. It's rotating very slowly. It's getting there. I believe in you. Uh, maybe not for long, though. You seem to be having a lot of trouble. Okay, maybe if I, like, run over here, it'll get out of there. No, it's still very much just... Okay, alright. Uh, I'll get in there, and then get back out very quickly, because, um... Yeah, you, there you go, you're free. Congrats. Oh god, I can't get out. What is going on? Why is it, like, having a rave? Oh, that was timed. Okay, so uh, we need to pull the lever. I need to get some oxygen first. Some of that good old O2 and um, pull the... Oh god, okay, let's try that again, actually. I'm not playing this on a dance pad anymore. Come on, we can do this. Go down. Pull the... Oh god, okay. Uh, this is a little bit harder than I thought it would be. You know, the, the water segments in the first game... Uh, second level of the first game nearly killed me so many times when I was playing on dance part because of just how difficult it was given the time segments and stuff, you know, trying to get her to line up with the levers and, oh god, it was nightmarish, like everything in Tomb Raider, I suppose, would be if you tried to play on a dance part. Uh, yeah. Out the water. Is there any reason to be out the water? No, there isn't. Okay, so it's just an air pocket. We can head back out and get out of here. Uh, was there a point in accessing the slidey bit? I don't think there was, was there? No, there's... Oh, wait a second, what's that? There is a flat platform just over on the right-hand side. I don't think we can... Oh, wait a second. No, no, that looks suspicious. That looks really suspicious now. Though I've mentioned it. Uh, how could I potentially get over there, though? I can't... I can't gravitate myself to actually jump over to the left when I'm sliding down there, can I? So, that's not possible. They've intentionally put the gate up there to prevent us from... I think this is later part of the level, really. I, I'm gonna speculate that is the case. Uh, yeah, there's no way to get over there at the moment, I believe. It's probably a secret. Probably a secret. Anyway, let's climb back up and go... Pop the keys in the door. I have a shotgun now. There's no point in going to the top. Okay, so uh, yeah, let's let's pop this open. So one key. No. Okay. I don't even know if she has a no in this game. Thinking about it, because I haven't had the opportunity to. Um, well, have actually thinking about it. You only have to examine it, don't you? The keyholes to get her to say no in this game. Right, and let's save right here. Do 
doing pretty well with this so far, I think. I think we're going to be done with this pretty quickly, because, uh, well, this is... Oh, hold on a second. This is quite dark. Is that the end of the level? No, it's just very dark. Wonderful. Hmm, sure wish I had an item which could allow me to see a bit better. Is that a dead end? I mean, you can fire, can't you? You can shoot, and that actually lights things up a bit, but then that will require me... Oh, okay. Well, that's something. We got a light on. Lovely. Uh, uh, maybe they were thinking, hey, next game. Maybe we should put something that actually gives you a light source that you can carry around. What a wonderful idea, Mr. Core Design. Are you dead? Yeah. Said whoever the fuck was listening to Core Design at that time. So, yeah, flares were introduced, as opposed to pulling a lever to, um... I'm saying lever again. Pulling a lever to, uh... You know, I, I'm, I'm having flashbacks to the comments years ago, people saying it sounds really strange when I say lever. So I should just stick to saying lever, because I, I, it is what I say at the end of the day. What, what? Where's my health ball? Oh, of course, I got the gun out. But what is the point in this? I hear something growling at me. Camera really doesn't like this place either. Yeah, um, because obviously I say lever, but I, I, I try to speak proper, proper with my playthroughs so people can understand me. You know, so that's a good idea. If people can understand me, you know, then they can watch the fucking thing and understand what I'm trying to say. Oh fuck. Okay, that's fine. Oh, are we on the other side of? Uh, oh, we might be. Oh, oh god, okay, there's a couple of places we can fall down here, we need to be careful. Sounds like something is kind of angry as well. Uh, very angry. Uh, oh Jesus. That's fine. Okay, what is off this edge? A drop. It's no big deal. We can hop around the corner. Um, what do we have here? There is a... Huh. Why, why is that there? No reason. Okay. Another drop directly in front of us. There is a, another lever here. That made the water happy. Uh, oh, hi. <laughs> Just running past at the right time there. It's like, hi. Hello. Yes, I am down here waiting to munch on you. And Laura's like, no. Do not munch on me. I am very unmunchable in my low polygon form. 720p. Upscaling. Beautiful. Yeah, obviously for the upload I'll upscale this to 1080p, but the reason I didn't record it in 1080p is actually because the um, elements that I spoke about earlier whereby you can see the, you know, the, the health bar and the amount of bullets and stuff like that were so fucking small that, yeah, they were not visible whatsoever. So I figured it would be better if I played this in 720p even though I'm playing on a 4K monitor <laughs> in 720p. So imagine the glorious image I have at the moment. I mean, actually, it looks fine. So, some people say, hey, you know, if you if you downscale on a... If you play in a lower resolution on a monitor that's a higher resolution... Oh, for fuck's sake, you would just land directly on... Oh, wow. Okay, that killed me fast. I'm gonna guess it's because it was inside me. They seem to do, like, a, a sudden load of hits sometimes. Anyway, I've got to repeat this now, which isn't a problem, really, but hey. 